Hi friends, welcome to Slide Hand with the video tutorial on mental math. To visit my channel, type www.youtube.com slash slide hand. In our previous tutorial, we learned how to square a two digit number. Now in this tutorial, I'm gonna teach you how to square a three digit number in a faster way. And I'll tell you some trick at the end of the video. So stay with us till end. For example, here we take 217. To find out the square of this number, first find out the difference between 217 and nearest hundreds number. Hundreds number means 100, 200, 300, 400 and so on. Nearest hundred numbers of 217 is 200 and the difference is 17. Next step is add 17 with 217 which is 234 then subtract 17 from 217 which is 200. Now multiply these two numbers. First multiply 234 with 2 which is 468 and then add this 2 zero here. Next step is square 17 and add with this number. 17 square is 289 and the result is 47089. So the square of 217 is 47089. Next number is 887. Nearest 100 number is 900 and the difference is 13. Add 13 with this number and we get 900. Next subtract 13 from this number and we get 874. Next multiply this two number and the result is 786600. Next square this number 13 square is 169 and add with this number and the result is 786769. So the square of 887 is 786769. Next number is 708. Nearest hundreds number is 700. And the difference is 8. 708 plus 8 is 716. 708 minus 8 is 700. Multiply these two numbers and we get 501200. Now square 8, 8 square is 64 and add with this number and the result is 501264. So the square of 708 is 501264. Well at the beginning of the video I promised you I'll tell you some trick. So let's discuss that. Here we divide all the three digit numbers into two parts. In the first part, the numbers are from 100 to 316 and in the second part, the numbers are from 317 to 999. If you square any number from 100 to 316, the result should be 5 digit. And if you square any number from 317 to 999, the result should be 6 digit. For example, here I'm gonna square 115 and the result is 13225. You can see here the result is 5 digit. Next I'm gonna square 317 and the result is 100489 and the result is 6 digit. If you know this trick, without calculation you can say the answer should be 5 digit or 6 digit. Another benefit is if you square any number from 100 to 316 and you get the result 6 digit, then you can understand it is a wrong answer and you do some mistake. This was about how to square a 3 digit number. It's very easy and simple but you have to practice a lot. Thank you for watching. I'll be back with another tutorial. Till then you take care and keep watching.